Hey, this is Aaron. And Blake, we're AB Data. Thanks for watching our Ultrix tool demonstration videos. In this video, we're taking a look at the test tool. The uh, test tool can be found in our developer category. As always, we're going to be using the example that is provided by Alteryx so that everybody has the data and can complete the same workflow. So let's grab a test tool and start looking at it. You'll notice that the test tool has kind of a bare configuration panel. Uh, there's not much there. Uh, what, what we're going to be doing first is we're going to be creating a test that uh, makes sure that the record count matches a specific value. So we're going to name our test count records. Our test value will set up to fail. We'll set it at 100 at first. We hit the run button and we get a message saying, hey, our expected number of records was 100, but really it was 236,000. Let's change our test value to 236,080 records and say OK, hit the run button. And now the test tool is happy. It doesn't throw any errors and uh, we're good to move on. We can also compare the record counts of multiple data streams. So that's what we'll be doing here. We're going to add a new test. We're going to say record counts match as our test name. We're going to select the second option. And then our test value is going to be input number two. So we have input connection number one should match input connection number two. And we see looking at our connection data that this is true. They do match. Let's grab another test tool. We can create a test where the expression is true for all records. So we're going to say true expression. And we're going to say where all of our location numbers are greater than one is going to be our test here. So location number is greater than one. I'm going to hit the run button, not get an error, but let's throw a wrench in here and edit our tests and say, let's see if our location numbers are less than one. We want to test for that. I'm going to say, OK, are they less than one? No, they're not. That expression failed on record number one because all of our location numbers are greater than one. So we'll go ahead and fix this. So we don't get errors as we move on to our last example where the expression is true for the first record, but then we're also going to create a secondary test. So first we're going to say that our uh, first expression is uh, going to be tested on the uh, first record here. So we're going to say our location number equals uh, 352096. 069. Okay. So we'll go ahead and hit the run button on that, but then we'll put in a secondary test as well. So we can hit the add button again for a next test, and we'll just do the initial test that we did where the record count matches a specific value. So we'll set this up for 236,080, and now we have multiple tests here that we can run. Thanks for watching today. Happy testing. Thank you for learning with us today. Good luck on your Alteryx journey. For more information on custom training, managed service automations, and more, please visit our website at abdataconsulting.com.